What's all this mess you made? Susie, that wasn't me! Who did it then? Uh, can you hear that noise? Interesting. Oh, why are all these things lying around here? It's as if somebody dragged them all the way to the bathroom. Looks like it. Oh, my fat eye! <laughs> Cute raccoon! Come here, little guy! Cute! So he made a mess in here! So what? He was probably bored! Bored? <laughs> Don't touch me! Oh, come on! Look at his cute face! I just can't! <laughs> if I made a mess like this, you wouldn't call me cute! Sam, he's our guest! Be polite! Oh, little raccoon, where are you off to? Let's play, little guy. Look! Hop, 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 hop. Uh. Susie, do you remember what we were going to do? Play with the raccoon? No, Susie, our craft! To make a video for our viewers! Oh, yes, all right. Don't be bored, dear raccoon. We'll be back to you soon. Hi, everyone. Today, we're going to play with the raccoon. What? I mean, make a game. There can't be too many games. Which game will it be? Well, do you remember how you kept bathing all the time? Uh, well, you kept running back and forth to the bathroom and back dirty and then clean. Oh, yes, yes. I told you then that I was getting dirty while I was thinking about a new video for our channel. Yes, so I suggested making a dunk tank game. And we'll dunk you into the water since you like bathing. Fun for you and fun for the viewers. Yes, that's me, the funniest slime in the world. Give a thumbs up if you agree. Will you need all of that? That's right. Well then, give me those sticks. I'll go cut them. Oh? Well, when I help your sister Samantha, I always cut either cardboard or sticks for her, but you've already cut the cardboard, so I'm taking the sticks. I'm a pro. Well, if you're a pro, then here. <laughs> right, I'll start with the plexiglass. We need to glue these five parts together to make something like a small swimming pool. I'll need special acrylic glue for this. Not a single drop will slip through. Just a bit more. Plexiglass is awesome for crafts. And done. Now let's make a sturdy base for our mini pool. I wrote all the measurements on the pieces. And the base itself is very easy to make. It's more like a big box. I'll just glue all the pieces with my trusty, rusty glue gun. Don't forget, be careful when you work with glue. I'll glue the sides to the bottom, carefully, and then cover it with the lid. And glue short sides. One. And repeat with the other side. Done! Our transparent mini pool will be right here. Sam will jump gracefully into it. <laughs> the first part is done. Right. I think all the pieces are ready. Um, Sam! That wasn't me! Oh, uh, what? There's a mess again! Oh, our little raccoon! Oh, I guess the raccoon got bored and decided to play with the toys. What if he starts munching your Barbie? Oh, that's fine. What if he munches Samantha's Barbie? Ah, uh, well, let's take it away from there. There, be a good raccoon and play only with the toy safe for you. I'm watching you. Really, he's so cute. Guys, have you ever played with raccoon? Write in the comments. And also write if you've ever made these awesome parts from sticks. Oh, Sam, thank you for the sticks. I'm going to need them now. And I... Could you watch over the raccoon, please? Fine. Right, and we're going to make a shooter for the ball. 
Let's take two cardboard circles and glue a wooden stick to one of them. Look, the stick has a notch on one end and an opening. We'll insert a wooden skewer into this opening and glue it well. Now, let's cut off the excess. Be careful with the cutter, guys. Watch your fingers. There. Now I'll apply some glue all over the edge of the circles and wrap them into a flexible piece of cardboard and press it. Sue! Sue! I'm shocked! What happened? The raccoon likes sweets, too! Yeah, you didn't know that? I know now! He found and ate all the marshmallows we had left! It's okay. You need to share with our guests. I hope Sam learns to be hospitable. What do you think, guys? Look, I stretched the rubber band and secured it on both sides, and we get this kind of a mini catapult. Let's put confetti in there. Do you remember how we made a cracker from balloons? Oh, that was so long ago, but of course I do. Go watch that video with the cracker if you didn't see it. Not only after you finish watching this video. And this cracker, well, I mean catapult, is for this little ball. Let's test it. Great. I brought the rest of the sticks. Sue. Sue! I just, uh, uh, stepped away. Yes, yes, I see. Really, if you don't want to make the game, just say it. I want to. See, I'm already making it. I was just waiting for you to bring the rest of the pieces and... Then a raccoon ran by. Exactly. Oh, Susan, Susan, I'm starting to think that you like animals much more than our channel. Sammy, how can you say that? Of course I love our channel more than anything. Fine, I believe you. And if you love our channel too, I'm sure you already subscribed and hit that bell button. Ah, uh, continue. Yes, yes. Guys, watch the next step closely. We need to connect these pieces made of wooden sticks with hot glue. The pieces are small, so take your time and watch your fingers, just like this. And that will make a stand for our catapult. I'll set it into place. Great. Now the last but not the least part of our game. I'll place three wooden pieces with openings in them onto a skewer and secure them with glue. They should be at approximately even distance from each other. Susie, can our raccoon replace a washing machine? What? Of course not, Sammy. What makes you think so? Well, he has to be useful. Otherwise, he'll just nick my candies. Oh, but you need to learn to share. Uh, well, fine. And we'll glue one more stick with an opening to a long, flat stick right here. And secure this piece onto our cardboard base. The raccoon went to wash stuff in the bathroom again! Let him wash, they like doing that. I'll tidy up later. If you tidy up after the raccoon, then I, I, I'll tidy up in here! Really? Thank you! Will you finish up soon? Soon. Just a bit left. I'll connect these two pieces carefully. It's important to make sure everything is aligned well or it won't work. Perfect! Two pieces are left! That's right, thanks! Let's glue the round piece here. It'll be the target. And... The rectangle goes here. It'll be the platform for the one to be dunked. <laughs> uh, too small for me. Is it? Then we'll take something else. There. Let's give it a try. Uh-huh. Aim. Fire! <laughs> I did it! Now let me. A moment. And there. Uh, what was that? Again! Sure. The ball goes here and... Fire! Yes! Did you see that? Let's play some more! Sure. So Jack Sparrow is ready for action. Oh, miss! Shall we do it again? Awesome! It's a good thing I didn't fit in there or I wouldn't be able to play. Speaking about playing, continue here and I'll go check on our furry friend. But, Sue, what about... Aww. <laughs> so sweet. Hey guys, today we'll be making a toy that can melt any cat's heart. Oh, I sure hope so. Hey Sammy, don't you want to say hello to the viewers? Alright, hi everyone. Hey guys. For starters, we'll need a big piece of cardboard, a ruler, a cutter, and uh, I don't get it. Where is it? 
Oh no, Sammy, I can't find the pencil. Yeah, just be gentle with it, okay? It's my favorite pencil. Okay, okay, Sam. Thanks for the help. I'm always happy to help, Susie. By the way, what are we making here? <laughs> it's high time you know, Sammy. It will be a whack-a-mole game for cats. Wow, that's my favorite game! I know what you mean, Sammy. I hope Fluffy will like it too. I've already made the marks here. See these X's? We'll have to draw lines from one to the other. Two, what if Fluffy doesn't like our idea? Why do you think so, Sam? Well, I don't know. He generally doesn't like cat toys. But we're making no ordinary toy here. That's true. We are making the coolest cat toy ever. Also, remember last time around we made a toy for Fluffy? He loved it back then. Labyrinth! It was a cat labyrinth. Right, Sammy. Do you remember it, guys? If you saw us make the labyrinth, be sure to comment and tell us. Or maybe you even tried making one yourselves. Okay, so it's time to cut our game out. Mind the numbers here. Be careful with the knife, guys. You can ask adults for help. Don't you worry, guys. I'm always keeping an eye on Susie. <laughs> right. That's why we don't ever have any incidents. Here's what we've got now. Now we're going to put together our game mechanism. Hmm, I think we need more of these guys here. Sammy! Got you, Susie! Thank you, Sammy. What would I do without you? You can ask adults to do it for you. There we go. See why we marked up our piece of cardboard? Now we have to make as many rods as we've drawn lines here. Ah! Materials delivery sign here, please. Wow, what's this? Thank you. It's right on time. I love slime delivery. Don't mention it, Sue. You know, I was thinking, why does Fluffy need a hunting instinct if he doesn't really live in wild nature? I mean, he doesn't really need to hunt. Well, only your sneakers. Yeah, he definitely likes that. It's a good question you're asking, Sammy. Maybe the hunting instinct is so strong in domestic cats that cats just can't help following it. Strong instincts. Wow! By the way, did you know that ancestors of present-day domestic cats made friends with the ancient people thanks to their skills of catching mice and other pests? Many cats bring mice and birds home nowadays too, surprising their owners big time. So let's see what we've got here. And now I'm going to use this metal rod. Look, we'll have nuts here. Speaking of nuts, where are they? Sammy, don't you know? <gasps> What's going on? Experienced goalkeeper Susan is in the goal. Oh. Ah, Susie's trying to catch the ball, but Sam avoids her and goal! Sammy. Why, what is it? Just admit that you missed the goal. How could I miss it if I wasn't even playing? Come on, Sue. It can happen to anyone. Oh, Sammy, you're such a restless slime. Pink slime with a sweet tooth. Well, at least you never get me bored. Okay, after all, the most important thing is that you did help me. Now we'll make this construction move. Just a sec. One moment. Almost done. Well, what did I tell you? Look, Sammy. Guys, you'll have to do the same to each stick. Wow! Can I try it later? Sure, Sammy. And now we'll need the following pieces. We'll use them to secure our rods. Yes, right. You just keep going here. I want to make sure that this game for Fluffy actually works. So, this is the last one. I'm sure that he'll be grateful to you, you know. Well, we are done here. We just need to arrange the nuts and you'll be able to get to testing it. I can't wait! Just a moment. And voila! Wow! I really like it! Time to get to the most interesting part! Wow! Well, it's time to make the, um, moles proper. We are going to make several dolls now that Fluffy is going to hunt. I want to make dolls! I want to make dolls! Sure, sure! Why don't you bring this mole to life? Oh, I'll do it just like that! Easy! Uh, okay. uh -huh. and, uh, 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 uh. Hey, don't look yet! 
Okay, okay. I'll finish mine in the meantime. Here. Ready! Wow! They are so different. Ha! It's just that my mole is a very strong and scary opponent. I don't doubt it for a sec. We already have holes made in our balls. And you guys should ask adults to help you with that. So the first mole is ready. To make other dolls, we used all kinds of little items. I'm sure you'll find something to use too. Huh, they say you have hunting instincts. Sam, it's all ready. Oh, I'll be right there. Whoa, this is super cool. Awesome. Oh, I love it. I'm glad you like it, Sammy. It's time to line up our game with walls. Hop, and it's done. We are really close to the finish line here, guys. We'll need these kind of PVC pipes and a cardboard part with holes in it for all the toys. Now we're going to make a remote control for our game. Wow, remote control sounds really cool. Right, Sammy. And these pipes will guide our buttons. Like this. We'll need fabric with holes in the middle to hide the moles from our fluffy. Okay. Guys, what do you think? Do I look good in this outfit? <laughs> Sammy, one can never get bored with you. I'm always here to serve. Almost ready. Oh, I'm ever so nervous. I think their time has come. Right. We'll use these bars to steer our moles. I finish it already! I can't wait to test this thing! Me too! In the meantime, I'll check if it's all working here. Oh, what do we got here? Let's test it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sorry, Sammy. I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> I think the test is passed successfully. <laughs> well, in that case, it's time to present the new toy to Fluffy. Yeah! Come on over. Good boy. Well, Fluffy, are you ready to hunt? One, two. Yeah! Get it, boy! <laughs> <laughs> yes, go, go, go! How do you like it, Fluffy? Enjoying yourself? Yeah! Aww. What do you think, Sue? Will we be able to get some sleep tonight? I don't know for sure, but let's hope so. Well, okay. Never mind. Today I've learned what hunting instinct is, and I think I got to understand Fluffy better. Good for you, Sammy. I'm not angry with Fluffy anymore. That's great news. Now it's time for us to say goodbye to the viewers. See you soon, guys. Be sure to give a thumbs up to this video if you liked it. Bye now. See you guys.